Oh, Rory, you are so wrong. So wrong. Can't you see her too? That's my sister. That's Carrie. Oh, shit! It's an entity! We need to get the hell out of here! Wait. We need to remain calm. We need to try and talk to him. Carrie! Carrie! I brought some friends. This is Alex, Michael, and Bella. They're gonna help us. Rory, that isn't your sister. It's... Shut up! That's Carrie! Can't you feel it? It's so familiar. I can prove it. She understands what I'm feeling. What I'm thinking. I've never been this close to anyone. Trust me, it's her! Rory, that's not Carrie. Rory, that's you. What? What the hell are you talking about? That's your sole survivor. Your spirit, your consciousness. How can that be? I'm right here! Vela, what the hell is going on? You need to explain this. Rory, what really happened to your sister? Something about your story doesn't add up. Let me hear the truth. Rory, please! I'm here to help you. Did your sister really vanish? No. She... She jumped off the overpass. Rory, that's... That's terrible. Why... Did she do it? What the hell kind of question is that? It was those bastards at school. Stupid, shitty girls always ragging on her, going out of their way to make her feel bad, picking on her for being my sister. Ugh! This is all my fault. It's all because of me, because of what I'm like, you know? How did you find this place, Rory? When did you first see your sole survivor? It was two weeks after she died. I found her things. I came down there thinking she fell down or something. I don't know. And then I thought, I thought about dying too. I wanted to die. I needed to get away from this world. I needed to find her. But you knew she was dead, didn't you? Of course. But I... It's okay. You can tell me. I'm not judging anything you say here. Tell me all of it. I surrendered myself to the ether. To the realm outside of this one. You know what I'm talking about, don't you, Bella? I do. Go on. What happened when you left your body? I didn't get far. I separated from my physical form, and then I saw my body and my sister, which you say is me. Did you leave the Earth? I was so close. I was so far away. And then I saw it. The sole survivor. The entity. Whatever the hell you called it. Rory, please listen to me carefully. You left your body when you surrendered yourself to your misery. You abandoned this physical form, and your soul was about to enter the soul space. But what you saw was not your sister. That soul over there is not hers. It is yours. I've traveled the soul space, and I understand what I am seeing when I look at the entities. I see the marks of your soul, and I can tell you that that is another you. Somewhere out there in the soul space, this you left his world and stumbled on yours. That's you from another plane. It's likely it was experiencing the same suffering as you. What? I don't understand. Fella, can you please explain what's going on here? Pain is inevitable. Suffering is optional. I understand what you were feeling. This depression is unbearable. I can't take it anymore. The depression pain part is an unavoidable reality. But whether or not you can overcome it is up to you. 
You decide if you're going to keep going. Your sister is gone. There's no changing that. But traveling the soul space is incredibly dangerous. And if you're not careful, you'll end up like him. You can't help but feel the pain. But you can get through the suffering. That will go away. Look, I know it's easy for me to say. I'm not the one whose sister is dead. But you have to understand that I am telling you the true reality of the situation. You're playing with some otherworldly dangers here. After reality, I find a similar scenario. Children playing a game they don't understand. No matter. As I have time and time again, I will remove your illicit presences. Soul Traveler, I sentence you to soul death. You will reside in this reality no more. Disgusting. And it is also disappointing. Reality after reality, I find a similar scenario. Children playing a game they, they don't understand. No matter, as I have time and time again, I will remove your illicit presences. Starting with you. The paralleled one. Interesting. You shouldn't be here either, Chance Traveler. And you, stitched into reality's fabric for dramatic effect. Playing the childhood mate, you don't belong. Perhaps the similarities between this scenario and the others are only surface level. Soul Traveler, I sentence you to soul death. You will reside in this reality no more! And now you, how will you justify your continued existence? <laughs> 